Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Helen Zapp, if you're new here, and I am going to be filming a video of me trying on clothes that do not fit me. I have a bunch of clothes from like years ago that don't fit me that I used to wear like all the time. And they're still hanging up into my closet right now because honestly, if I didn't have them, my closet will be empty. And I honestly only have like seven or eight outfits I actually wear and the rest are just clothes that don't fit me and I don't want to buy new clothes because I'm on this weight loss journey. And I know that I will fit into these clothes in the future because I'm getting super serious about my weight loss and all that. I decided to do this because I wanted something to look back on in the future where I have a clip of me trying on um, this piece of clothing that didn't fit me. And then I'll have an after uh, clip pic, after pic, no, after video clip of me trying it on again and it, it'll actually fit me. So I wanted like a, instead of like a before and after picture, I wanted a before and after video of me struggling to try it on and then a video of me that actually fits perfectly. And I felt like this would be a great non-scale victory for me in the future because it's really motivating. Yeah, I have a couple of pieces that I thought about trying and um, some of this, these pieces I really really liked and I honestly actually do have some clothes that I still have tags on because I either really really liked it at the time when I bought it or I thought it will fit me and it didn't and I just got too lazy to return it. Before I forget, first off, my recap for this week, I am doing so well, so great. Um, on Monday it was President's Day, I didn't do too bad, I did eat kettle corn which is really really bad for you but other than that, from Tuesday to Friday, we worked out, we ate healthy, I'm still intermittent fasting, and I'm doing really, really great so far. My scale right now is fluctuating from 190 to 193. I haven't weighed myself yet. I usually like to weigh myself in the morning on Sunday, and right now is Saturday, so I'll just um, insert a little clip of me here of my weight and we'll see if I lost weight or not or stay the same. I just picked out all the clothes I wanted to try on but I also wanted to mention that I wanted to do this video as soon as possible because I already have like two clothes that I found that actually like used to be really snug on me but now it's like loose fitting so the sooner I do this the better. First I gotta clean really quick. Does anybody else like feel the need to clean in order to relax? Like I cannot think straight when my house isn't clean. And I was wondering, do any of you guys like have that tendency at all? Just leave in the comments below so I know I'm not alone. <laughs> I'm a little bit nervous about making this video be just because I know that I'm gonna look probably a little bit silly and stupid in it, knowing that I can't fit into these clothes and I'm probably gonna have a hard time taking them off. But I know this is for my own purpose and for my own weight loss journey and something that I will look back on and tell myself that, hey, I did it. Right, first shirt that I'm going to try on. Let's see if I can fit it. Um, kind of, no, don't fit it. It's a little bit snug. Use my rolls right there. Ew. is this long shirt sweater that I got from Macy's it's an extra large but look at it like I just don't fit into it last time I got it and I just don't fit into it it's a little bit short on me I don't want it this short on me Here's another shirt or cardigan that I bought at Nordstrom Rack that I thought would fit into me, but it did not. I'm pretty sure my arms wouldn't even fit into this. Oh. No, not really. It's a little bit snug. Yeah, it's really snug. It's really tight on my arms, so that's a no-no. This used to be one of my favorite shirts to wear like every day just because it matches with everything. And I don't fit into it anymore. This is like my 
most favorite sweater that I got from J.Crew. And I have to iron this area, but I used to wear this so much. Yep, doesn't fit me. Oh my gosh, this used to be so loose on me. It's just, I'm so disappointed what I did to myself. This is also another sweater. Oops, sorry, Joe. That I got from J. Crew, and I used to wear this a lot. Also, it was my favorite. And I don't think my arms fit into it, honestly. No, it doesn't. That's all it goes up to up here. My arm, my arm is like right here, and it stops like right here. So it doesn't fit. I'm not gonna even try the other arm. This shirt my sister just got for me for Christmas. But yeah, it's really tight. I don't like wearing tight clothes. This I also used to wear just like casual. This is my shirt that I used to fit, and look at that. It doesn't even cover my whole freaking tummy. This shirt, I think I can still fit into it, but the thing is, it's really short, so... I just have to lose weight to wear this again. Yeah, I don't like how short it is because you can like see my gut right here and I don't like showing my gut. I like to like wear oversized clothes where like it covers my whole like, like just like up to here my whole gut. I hate, I hate it so much. This is another shirt that I wore like years ago. I still love it. It's one of my favorites. Um, I think I got it when Danny and I started dating back in 2011, 2012. And this was just one of my favorite, favorite shirts that I got at Nordstrom. Nope. Nope. Just nope. Don't fit into it. Um, at the end of my weight loss journey, my main goal is to be able to wear shorts because I have never been able to wear shorts and the only time I did I have felt extremely self-conscious about it. Like I would always try to pull my shorts down and I would use my crossbody bag to like try to hide my thighs and all that. So that is my video for this day. I am sorry that it sucks and the lighting really, really sucks, but that's what you guys get right now until I get to afford a new camera. I hope you all have a great day and stay healthy, stay focused. Don't give up when you guys already did bad and just keep on going. You will get there, you will do it, and you will feel so good. All right, bye guys, I'll talk to you soon. Keep zapping the weights.